So I had a really great question yesterday on my most recent video that I posted and it's by a guy whose profile is Hyuga Zero. I hope I've pronounced that right. Uh, so this video is dedicated to you, my friend, and it's one I know is going to answer a lot of things for other guys too. And his question was, how do you make a girl feel more comfortable in a cold approach situation? Now, this is a great question because you're not looking to purposely try and comfort the women that you're speaking to in your interactions. The actual answer, in fact, is going to be more of a ripple effect of what things you can do to yourself to make her more comfortable being around you. So one of the things that uh, I don't think maybe guys uh, tend to think about is that women have this very intuitive sense about people. They've kind of got this like sixth sense feeling. They can feel what you're feeling and they just know. It's a bit like, I've used this analogy before, but it's a bit like, you know, if you go and see your mum or you're spending time around your mum and you've had a bad day maybe at work or at uni or for anyone younger at school, and uh, you've come home and, and you, you're in a bit of a strop and she just knows. She's like, what's happened? What's the matter? And you're like, I'm fine. I'm fine. Nothing's the matter. She goes like, come on, tell me what's the matter. And she just knows that kind of like motherly intuition. Well, women, I do genuinely believe, have that same feeling that when you go and speak to them, when you're cold approaching them, they get your vibe. Um, they can feel if you're confident and they can feel if you're being anxious. Now, both of them are going to be absolutely fine, but it's how you compose yourself with your confidence or with your anxiety and shyness. So the more control that you have over it, then the more likely she's going to be relaxed around you. So I know for me, uh, in my very early days when I was cold approaching, um, I used to get incredibly anxious. You know, back then it was this concept of like, you've got to get into flow state and then that's when it's great to go and talk to people. And I really do like that philosophy. But when you tend to go to a more fundamental uh, or foundational level with that, what you're looking at is you're trying to ground yourself. You're trying to relax your anxiety or not let it be at such an intense level that is going to make you anxious. And obviously when you're anxious and someone else feels and notices that, you're going to kind of make them anxious. So most guys, when they start cold approaching, the reason why maybe a lot of their interactions are going bad, okay, yes, besides them being scared and nervous and shy, they're doing something well and truly out of their comfort zone, um, they maybe don't know what to say, they're not used to it, it's still a stretch and whatnot, but it's also going to be the women are going to feel that anxiety or they're going to feel that nervousness and unfortunately there's also an element of unpredictability there as well. So that's what then makes women kind of nervous. They're like, I, I don't know what this guy wants or what kind of like actions or is going to take here. You know, and unfortunately there are bad people out there and, you know, you hear of horror stories in the news or, or elsewhere where, you know, either people have been attacked, mugged, kidnapped and so on. Now, I'm sure you're all great normal guys, which is is really important here, but it's just worth bearing in mind that your anxiety or your over nervousness could have her thinking about these particular things. And if she doesn't want to have herself in that situation, which to be honest is absolutely fair, then of course she's going to reject you, say no, say she's not interested, walk away, ignore you and so on. So the caveat or counter of that is you have to relax yourself and I do genuinely believe that the more you can take control of the symptoms of anxiety, then the easier it is to overcome them. So when you're putting yourself into a cold approach situation and you want to make the girl more comfortable around you, try and slow down your speed of speech, 
Try and take deep breaths. Try not to look around. Try and hold eye contact and relax yourself. That's simply it. Just try and learn to get comfortable relaxing yourself or get comfortable in your own skin and relax yourself. And the sooner you can take control of the symptoms of your anxiety, you will find that she will very easily and very comfortably relax into the interaction as well. And she'll feel very comfortable around you. And this is why it's so good to get desensitized to cold approaching and also not to put too much pressure on yourself in thinking that if you're new to cold approaching, that this all has to be perfected like on the first day or the first approach that you do. Unfortunately, you probably will weird out some women, but this is kind of why it's so important to go to a coach to get you through that nervousness weird anxious kind of phase or or yeah I'm, I'm not going to use any other words here but you want to get out of that phase really as quickly as possible because the sooner you can relax into your interactions then actually you will find it very comfortable to have normal conversations and talk about whatever you want and when you get really desensitized and used to speaking to strangers you'll start bringing in your humor you'll start being very cheeky and flirty and of course, that's where then you will be seen with this more sexual confidence and she'll feel even more comfortable around you and there'll be even higher levels of attraction, excuse me, as well. So point being, if you want to make women feel more comfortable around you in your cold approach situations, you just got to try and relax yourself more. That's that's really what it comes down to. And when you relax more in the conversations and cold approaches, then you will be giving off this more relaxed, confident kind of vibe or comfortable kind of vibe, even if you want to um, emphasize that. And that is where then she will feel it and she'll go along with it. So she'll feel constantly what you feel. So as long as you can stay relaxed, she'll feel relaxed too. And then you can have a very easy conversation. And even then for guys who are nervous and they don't know what to, how to handle those situations, call out that you're nervous. There is nothing wrong with that. If anything, even by uh, pointing out the elephant in the room about your awkwardness or shyness can also help to make someone feel comfortable with you because at least you are showing some level of vulnerability there. So I hope that answers your question, uh, Hayuga Zero. Uh, great, great title there uh, or username. Um, but that's that's simply what it is. Um, the more you relax, then the more comfortable she'll be around you. There's nothing that you need to necessarily say or actively do to, you know, try and win her over to saying, look, I, you know, be comfortable around me. Uh, if anything, that's probably only going to push her away even further because she's like, well, why is he having to justify this to me? But if you can just relax yourself um, in your conversations, imagine like how you'd be talking to like your best friend or family member or work colleague and so on. You know, if you can just relax yourself, she'll be relaxed too. And if you can be comfortable in an interaction, she'll feel comfortable too. And um, and it's and it's simply that there, there's not really much more more to it. Uh, fortunately, it's one of those kind of topics that I think guys think maybe there is like some particular thing they have to say or do, um, you know, to the woman to to get her to think in this kind of way. But actually, actually, just relax yourself, whether it be like through meditation, whether it be through deep breathing exercises, mindfulness. Um, I actually really like the Wim Hof stuff. But when you just go in to speak to people, just take deep breaths. And also just bear in mind that when you become desensitized to cold approaching, uh, there'll still be an element of anxiety and fear there, but it will, um, yeah, it won't really show that much. And you can always just call out the elephant in the room and say, look, I'm, I am a little bit nervous uh, speaking to you. You're incredibly attractive and I don't normally do this. How's your day going? Even that will let her know like, okay, well, you know what? He is anxious. He's a little bit nervous to come and speak to me, but he's got the balls to go and do that. Um, I'll give him the time of day and hear him out. Uh, and in fact, she'll help you to relax as well. Like if she starts speaking, it gives you an opportunity to, you know, take a deep breath and just, 
just calm down. So yeah, that's that's pretty much the uh, the answer there. Um, I wanted to really sort of flush it out for you, but yeah, that is that is pretty much it. So of course, guys, I've been Dan, that dating anxiety guy. Uh, if you can like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel. I really want to reach even more guys and help them with overcoming their anxiety with meeting women, especially if it's through cold approaching. Um, and of course, you know, comment below this video. In fact, I'd love to hear, have you ever found yourself in a situation where you've been really nervous and wondered how to, you know, try and relax yourself into the interaction or how to build better comfort between you and the girl? Love to hear your thoughts below. And also, if you've got more questions that you'd love for me to answer in videos, then please do put it below as well. Uh, other than that, if you do feel that you need some coaching, do check out my website. I particularly help people with cold approaching and their anxiety through starting off their journey with it. Um, and uh, so far, my clients have had some really fantastic results. So I'm really, really pleased. But if you want to check that out, have a look at my website. But just to finish up, the important thing to remember is the more you can relax into your interactions or the more that you can relax into your cold approaches, then the more comfortable she will be around you too.